Welcome back to Getting Started with Apache Solar Search Server with me, Robert Elwell. This is Section 3, Manipulating the Index. In this section, we will discuss how to add documents to the Solar Index using the Update Handler, how to update documents or delete them from the Index using the Update Handler, and using the Data Import Handler to transfer data from other sources. Now that we have our Solar Instance up and running, we need to get data into the index. You can note that we don't have anything in the index now, because if you go to the statistics view, you can note that numdocs is zero. You can also perform a search on this query string, which basically will match any document with any field. So as we can see, there are no documents available to us. So the Apache project has had the foresight to add in some example documents for us to work with when looking at the example setup. So you can note these in example docs under the example folder. So let's take a look at a few of these. First off, good one to start with would be iPod. So let's take a look at iPod other .xml. So as you can see, the document begins with an add tag and then follows with the document's definitions as they are shown. So the field values are named by the name attribute and the values between the field beginning and end tags are the actual values for these fields. Note that an add command includes a closing tag for um, the add node. This basically says add these two documents to the index. We also have in this example post.jar file which is responsible for posting data to the index. You can also use this for your own XML if you don't feel like writing your own library to handle but actually opening the request and, and sending that along. So we can use java-jar post.jar iPod other.xml and that defaults to localhost. If you wanted to send it to a different URL you would have to do dash D, capital D that is, URL. So this is shorthand basically for dash D URL equals http colon slash less localhost colon three slash solar slash update. Same deal. So let's take a look at what we have in info now. Actually in statistics. So number of docs is two. Let's do this same query again and see what we get. So now we have some more results in the response. 